Okay, so we are back at Walmart. We are doing a Walmart grocery shop with me finally. I know a lot of you have said that you missed these on my channel. So I'm finally doing one today and hopefully we can find some really good stuff, some really good finds. I probably haven't been to Walmart to look around for new stuff in like three weeks and it's my birthday. So wish me luck and let's get started. So I just found this, I'm not really sure. I guess this is like a leave-in conditioner, but I think it's new and I might try it. The color is what caught me. The packaging gets me every time, y'all know this. I was just about to say I did not know that Dr. Till's had shampoo and conditioner, but apparently it's new. So you guys know I'm not a huge fan of dry shampoo, but I really do want to start using it and washing my hair less and i saw somebody post this on instagram and i think it's new i think i want to try this one right here it's 548 though i wonder if it's worth it apparently some of these body washes are new i've never seen this one before for sure or this one right here they also have this fiji knots ones as well okay look at all of the new kiss nails they have they are so adorable they have all of the spring colors out they have these over here y'all know when i come to walmart and do a grocery shop with me i always show you guys a little bit more than groceries if i find anything that i like but i did not find any bubble bath which is a bummer I definitely need a new spring scent air freshener, but I don't know which one to get. I've never seen this one before. So I'm definitely going with this one. That other one smelled like trees. Found these, I'm pretty sure these are new. Let me know if they're not, but I've never seen the kettle cooked in flaming Hot. Has anyone ever tried any of the flavored Smart Water? They have watermelon mint and cucumber lime. Also, I've never seen these Deer Park waters in the cans. They're flavored. We've got the pomegranate lemonade, lemon lime, black cherry, lemon lime, black cherry, and raspberry lime. They do have two Funfetti creamers left, but I already have it in my refrigerator, but it's so good, you need to try it. I don't know if you guys saw my Target video, but Cherry Vanilla Coke is new. Everybody says that it's not new, it's been out forever. It actually has not. So if you haven't tried it, go get it, try it. It wasn't my favorite. It didn't taste that different to me, but it's not bad. Okay, someone told me to try this. I cannot remember who told me, I wish I did, because I like to give credit where credit's due, but I have to get this. Cran Tropical has to be good. Apparently these are new limited edition. I'm pretty sure I've showed these before. Maybe they're old new, but the girls want them. You gonna eat them? Yeah. Okay. Well, this is pretty exciting. They do have Easter egg Oreos. Wonder how they taste. Here you go. This is new, not that exciting, but look. Tote and go crackers. You think that's enough crackers for us? Why do I feel like these are new, but not new? They look different. Alex just found these for the girls. They're really excited. Let's be honest though, he likes tricks too, so that was probably a trick in itself. I know these are new, but I'm not gonna get them because Mandy told me about them and she said that they were not good. So I trust her and I'm not gonna waste my money. For all of you Fruit Loop lovers out there, you might wanna give them a try. Okay, somebody tell me if these are new. I know they have cinnamon Pop-Tarts, but I've never seen frosted cinnamon roll. Okay, I showed these in my Instagram stories the other day. These are new, kind of expensive, $1.50. If you felt these, they're actually really light. Okay, I did find one more in the Chips Ahoy and it's crushed. So I was hoping I would find the mug treats that I saw at Target the other day in the lemon. I should have got them when I saw them, but I didn't. And now Walmart doesn't have them. Hello. hello again more new stuff and then apparently these jellos are new too they have cherry blue raspberry and lemon apparently 
this soup is new, but they don't have my favorite broccoli and cheddar soup. They only have the one with the bacon, which I really don't like that much. Okay, this one looks interesting, so I think I'm gonna try this. Okay, I don't know if these unicorn cupcakes are new. I thought they had mermaid ones and they look exactly the same, but just in case. They also have these limited edition carrot cake donuts on the go, um, but that sounds disgusting. Also found the strawberry cupcakes, which are also limited edition. So of course, getting close to Easter, they have all of the flavors of Peeps, but I've had so many of you tell me about these root beer float peeps. I don't even like root beer, but I did find these. This is very interesting. Fruit loop peeps. Also, a lot of you mentioned these that are dipped in chocolate. Walmart does have these as well. Literally all of the Easter candy. Makes me so excited. I love to fill up my girls' Easter baskets every year. Okay, I've seen so many people on Instagram talking about these and saying you could find them at Big Lots, but apparently Walmart has them too and I have to get it. I just have to try this. Okay, we're totally going with this this time. So I'm not sure if these are new, you'll have to tell me, but they have mini bowls for your tacos, flour bowls, and I've never seen the taco shells with a hint of lime. We always like to get the stand-up ones, but I've never seen these. Wait a second. Cookies and cream flavored sauce. Um, this is definitely coming home with me. So I've never seen these. Budweiser beer battered crab poppers. That's interesting. Okay, they have these, which they used to carry at Target and they're actually really good. And then unicorn berry, I've never tried those. So I'm off to check out, I've never seen these before. And then these Mentos are apparently new as well. Okay, so I feel like that was a successful trip. I also feel like there's always somebody screaming in Walmart or outside Walmart. Right now it's outside Walmart. Hopefully you can't hear it. But when I get home, I will show you everything that we got. All right, so we are back home and I'm gonna show you what we got from the grocery store. And you can still guess, of course, just like always, how much my grocery haul was. And I will send you either a Starbucks or a Dunkin' gift card. And the winners for my last two grocery hauls, because I did not mention those on the last grocery haul I did, were Rebecca Washburn and Stacy Grier. So Rebecca and Stacy, if you just want to email me or message me on Instagram, that would be great. With that being said, let's go ahead and get started and I will show you everything we got. Okay, sorry if it's a little dark in here. I feel like the lighting is off, but today we just got a half gallon of milk. We do have a whole gallon of milk in the fridge already, but if you know me or you've been watching my channel for a while, you know I have this weird thing about running out of milk. I'm just scared to run out of milk because milk is used for pretty much everything. So I did get that just in case. You never know what I'm gonna make this week. Got some of this Cran Tropical Ocean Spray Juice. This is a new flavor. I'm so excited to try it. Had to restock on my cold brew coffee, of course. Got some Cherry Dr. Peppers back there. We also picked up some Steamable Corn, Sweet Peas, and Blueberries. And then, of course, Strawberries. And then Blueberry Yogurt. We also got some Bananas. Two cans of SpaghettiOs just for the girls. Sometimes they like to snack on this after school. I found this, which I showed in the beginning of my video. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited to try this. Also got this taco dinner kit. It is the nacho cheese shells, so I'm really excited about that. Some creamy chicken noodle progresso soup. They did not have my broccoli cheddar like I wanted. They only had the kind with the bacon, which I really don't like that much. And then I've never seen this one before, chicken cheese enchilada flavor, so I decided I would give that one a try. Also picked up these flour tortilla bowls because the girls probably will not eat those. Got some gogurt to go in Ansley's lunch, and then of course I'll Reese three yogurts that she takes during the week. Also got some eggs and I know, gross potted meat, but Ansley loves it, so I let her get some. We got some Vienna sausages. These are also for Ansley, she loves them. Some ham for sandwiches. 
Alex found these and these are great value brands. So hopefully they are pretty good. He loves anything jalapeno flavor. Got some Trix cereal with marshmallows, just some fruit snacks to go in lunches, Uncrustables to go in lunches. We got some bugles for the girls. And then we usually don't buy this kind of ground meat beef, but we did like the last two times. Let me know what you think. We usually buy the lean ground beef that is in like the, I don't know, the square packaging. Let me know if you think there's a difference. And then we got some sharp cheddar cheese. I just like to keep this on hand. I showed you guys this in the store as well. Fruit Loops Bunny. I don't know. I had to get it and I'm going to try it and I'll probably show it on Instagram. So if you're not following me on Instagram, I'll leave my handle on the screen like somewhere around in here. You can go follow me and see what I think about it. Here are the sandwich crackers that Alex decided to get this week. I've never seen the cheddar cheese Cheetos ones, but they might not even be new. Got some little bites cookies for lunches and snacks, some sour cream. The girls love sour cream on their tacos gum for Alex. We also got a half a loaf of the Sara Lee bread and then Popper needed this. Also got some mouthwash and then this is the exciting part for me. I'm gonna try this new dry shampoo in the tropical fragrance. Really excited about that. I picked up this conditioner. I love any conditioner or shampoo in general that has the pump on it. it makes it so much easier. I got this fragrance to spray in like the bathrooms and around the house. Also got this shampoo, which it's not focusing very well, but I got this, it smells so good. So if you find it at your Walmart, you have to smell it and see if you like it. I can't wait to try it. Also picked up some Epsom salt cause I was out and I really like the melatonin one. It's new and I've been buying it ever since it came out. So definitely try it if you've never tried that one before. But yeah, this is basically my entire grocery haul this week. We already had a lot of stuff we needed, so we just picked up in between things that we would need throughout the week. Almost forgot, we did get some toilet paper. So, thank you guys so much for watching another Walmart Shop With Me and Grocery Haul. I hope you loved it. If you're new to my channel, make sure to subscribe if you like videos like this because I do them on my channel every week. I do Shop With Me's literally all the time probably more than i should but i do a good job now of not even buying anything so that's good but if you like those type of videos subscribe i would love to have you if you liked watching this video give it a thumbs up and i will see you guys in my next one bye